Hello and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Apocalypse. We have a, uh, a Sky uh, not Sky Ranger, we have a Badger full of, uh, the only person standing behind is Spliffy Puss, who he probably could come, but we'll let him sit one more day and get, uh, fully healed. But eight is plenty, I think. And we are going to head up here to this, uh, this Mutant Alliance office. The Mutant Alliance, if I remember correctly, are the ones, I don't know what their symbol is, but they're the ones that provide the uh the mutants to us so if we want i don't know who they are i don't know what they look like oh this one yes first wave of alien incursions resulted in many genetic experiments involving crossbreeding humans and the alien species known as sectoids these hybrids have survived in human society but they have been denied their right to procreate within the city they also suffered discrimination and employment and education Though they're genetically almost identical to humans they remain retain some alien facial characteristics and are renowned and distrusted for their psionic abilities. Hybrid psionic uh, abilities may prove well prove useful to XCOM in the war against the aliens. The mutant alliance is active in city politics and promotes the concerns of a hybrid community. So the um, I read somewhere, somewhere in the backstory about the mutants in this game. Um, when it talks about the first wave of alien incursions resulted in many genetic experiments. This first wave it talks about is um, Roswell. I, if I remember correctly. The, the first aliens that showed up were, was, was back before the first alien war. And so there was like this underground society of these uh, crossbreeding mutants. And for a long time, they sort of stayed hidden. But then they came back out, um, I guess, to rejoin society. And nobody likes them because they are not human. Anyways, let's go save the day. We have this, we have, do we have any down UFOs? Did I pick them up already? Uh, looks like there's one right there. Alright, let's go investigate. We saw them drop off here, so we know they're here. This should be nice and easy. Everyone has a toxic gun. I didn't bring any, uh, this, um, devastators this time. All toxic guns. We need to re replenish our shield supply, and this should do it. Alright, what do we got here? So we're both on opposite sides of the room here. And it looks like there's a hallway. It's all mostly one level. Okay. Well, group one. Well, first we'll go to aggressive. And aim shot. Aim shot. So group two, let's go ahead and move you over this way. And group one, we'll head this way. See what we can find here. Lots of civilians. Oh, 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 we got a brain sucker. Did I have that? Do I have that off? Why didn't it pause? I might. Um. How see it spotted? Yeah. What? Whatever. Oh, there it is. No. Will we whipped? We get it for him, but not the brain sucker? Alright, so you guys just stop right here and go ahead and, and do your thing. Um, I wonder if we can come around this way. Make our way over here. Start running. What are you doing back here, buddy? Why are you so slow? These dang mutants. I, I know why they're segregated against, because they're so dang slow. Alright, mowed him down nicely. Mow him down, too. Please. Thank you. So group two, let's go stand right here. I'm guessing there's lots of things in here. Um, what, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, we got a worm. Okay, just come to there. Shouldn't be an issue. You know what? Sometimes I wish I wish I had brought the Devastators, but I guess it's okay because then I would be tempted to start blowing holes in walls. Which uh, makes people cranky. For some reason. You know, you know if... Hey, I can't get through here. Yeah, I really need a hole in the wall. Could throw a grenade, but that seems dangerous. Uh, are we shooting them? It would really be a good idea. So, I don't think it uh, does me much good to put auto shot on with toxic guns. I could be wrong, but that's a comment that I read. Uh, because the... The auto shot is faster 
than what the snapshot does. So, we won't be doing that anymore. Oh, there's a door here. Are we running? Oh, shoot him. Thank you. Um, I'm tempted to just walk in here, because if this has got to be where they're at. We could go down here and check it out. Uh, let's, let's, like, stand in the doorway. You. Who are you? Devilkin. I got a mission for you, buddy. Check out that door. There's nothing over here, either. Or down here, I assume. We're gonna go look. One of you. The rest of you. Come on over here. They could be downstairs, I suppose. Oh, there's a downstairs ramp right there. Oh, is there an upstairs here? Oh, there is. Nothing? Alright. Come back over here. Space Voyager. What do you see? Nothing? Here you go. Yeah, come, come explore for me. Alright, so one of you is going to go downstairs, and one of the other group will go upstairs. We're going to let Space... Is this Space Voyager? Devilkin. We're going to let Devilkin do a little more exploring. Probably one alien out for a midnight stroll here. I hear it. Nothing? Nothing. Okay. Uh, come on back to your friends. Group one. There's a door here. Let's go look. Oh, oh there we go. There we go. Oh, there's an anthropod pod there. Okay, nicely done. Who is this? Space Voyager. Yeah, mow him down, Space Voyager. Nice. So we have an anthropod standing right here. Can we, uh, just wait for him to come out? He will certainly come out eventually. He's in the toilet. Hiding in the toilet like a coward. Alright, yeah, you just stay there. We know where he's at. We got him? Oh, it's another spitter. What's going on in the bathroom here? Yeah, shoot that guy. Stop taking hits. Thank you. Shoot that guy too. What? How many of them are in the bathroom? <laughs> there we go. They're all hanging out in the bathroom. Uh, Boxer and Brutes promoted. We got some equipment. We got maybe like one shield out of that. Not worth the loss of Toxic Gun ammo. Oh well. But no one got injured. I don't think we lost any shields. Space Voyager may have lost one. Um, let's go run by here. Were those the drones, or were they the scouts? Okay. What are you shooting at? Yeah, good job. Shoot that... that thing. Uh, where's the other one? Okay, yeah, that's it. Pick that one up. What is this? Oh, wait, wait. I'm clicking wrong things. No, go here. All right, head home. And we just had the UFOs show up, so they will probably won't be showing up anytime soon. Where's my, um... I got no live aliens from that batch? All right, how are graphs looking? Cult of Sirius was on the rise, but they're, going, they're dropping almost as fast as they rose, so that's good. And I think research is still coming along fine. What have we got? We have no biochemistry, because we don't have a skeletoid still. Work on the advanced workshop, is a, which is which will be good. And then we can get the biotransport. Uh, toxic guns being made, toxic gun type B being made. I'm happy with what is happening. We'll con continue the day here this Tuesday. We'll advance a bit. Oh, ho! Nice. Our advanced workshop is done. Larger pieces of technology require more space and power to construct. The advanced workshop is, is not designed 
For a large construction project such as uh, new vehicles, the facility can accommodate up to 10 engineers. Excellent. Uh, next up, there's the biotransport module, which will, we will, or the craft that will build at that larger place. I guess the medium disruptor will be the thing to do. We need a large lab for that. So, oh, that's not, never mind. That's engineering. So let's build a lab. We'll put a lab in here. It probably is time to build a new base. Um, where is it? There it is. Pop it right there. Okay, nine days. We're still not... We're not super rich. We could, probably could sell a lot of stuff, though. Actually. Let's make sure Illyrium is all bought out. Because uh, we have a lot of... Well, the, label, the sniper guns can go. Laser pods can go. Auto cannons. We don't need those anymore. Plasma guns, plasma pods. Uh, the heavy launcher. Mini launcher can go. Even though it is exciting. Hang on to the stun grapple. We might one day use it. Yeah, we'll hang on to that too. Uh, we could dump those. Uh, we'll keep those three, I suppose. We have 56 devastators. <laughs> And we have 74 boomeroids. Alright, so here's our money. We only need like 10 of these. I'll keep 15. Uh, that's 200 grand. 250. We have 300,000 bucks now. Now what do I spend it on? Uh, so we can build a new base. That's, that's one probable plan. Um... Hmm. Where would we put the base? I, I guess ideally we want a manufacturing base, which we'd put... I'm not sure it's too important. I mean, somewhere I would think centrally located would be fine. Um, oops, it's fast. We could buy something like something small. The, uh, the slums are big, like our base is now. And we could get a lot of workshops in there. Or we can get the smaller ones. We may not have a lot of op options to build in the smaller ones. How much does it cost to build a new, buy a new building? Like, what about the slums? How much is this? This is only 80000 And we could get... We could get a lot of workshops in here. Um, Let's hold off a bit longer. Well, maybe we should go ahead and do it. Why not? Let's do it. Um, oh, here's this one here. What's this? Oh, this looks even nicer. Yeah, I like this one. This one's only 32. Nice, this is cheap. Okay. Um, buy it. Oh, we gotta come up with a name. This is gonna be manufacturing base. Um, what should we name it? I don't know. Man, you... Base. Manufacturing base. Okay. So... You. We want to get a, an advanced workshop. It costs us 12 grand. It's nice and cheap. There. And should I put two of them in? Yes. I could even do a third one if we want lots of mass production. We have loads of money. We'll do the two for now. That's 20 engineers we'll have to buy as well. Uh, we'll need to buy some engineers here, but not for nine days, so there's not really any hurry for it. Um, not this one. I want uh, this one. Oh, we do have an agent, Karen. Come on over, Kevin. Karen. Andrea Hill. I might actually end up hiring Andrea Hill. Maybe. Um. Okay. So she'll head back. There we go. And we'll get her name. But for now, we're gonna basically just sit and watch graphs. Evo Net. Is there an EvoNet up here? What does EvoNet look like? There they are. Um, no, there's not. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. It was this one. So, yeah, I bet you there's something here. Should I go there? Let's go. This one, right? Yes. The water purifier. Hi, 
Hydra Zone 1. Oh, man. Alright, go home. We'll do the day. Um, four hours, we can do it. Okay. Now we should send our people out. Whoops. There. And there. Okay. We have proper manufacturing going on, right? We're almost done with our clips, so we'll bump some more of those up. Um, yeah, none of that. And not until we get our bigger base, our bigger manufacturing base, can we build any of these. So I'm okay with what we got. Okay. Should have UFOs showing up here very soon. Yes. Did I finish it? Oh, the toxic guns. Toxic guns were done. Do I need more of them? Well, how many do we have now? It'll just tell me how many extra ones I have. I have eight extras. Is that enough? I'm going to use these basically the rest of the game. Maybe we should make a few more. Is there anything that we desperately need, though? Other than that? I don't think so. We'll keep cranking them out. Crank out. We don't... Yeah, like that many more. Okay. Another day is done. We should probably be getting UFOs very soon. Research complete. Medium disruptor beam is now done. Excellent. Medium disruptor beam is a more powerful version of the light disruptor beam. It uses the same, same subatomic interdimensional technology, but the energy chamber is larger. It is capable of penetrating the heaviest armor. Right. The shields. We want shields. Um, now we can look at our craft. And I think, yes, we do have some of these. What if I give you this? I can't use this really on anything that I have. Nothing will, will equip it. But this is 40 damage. Okay, these are nice. These still worth keeping 26, 25. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. There's a UFO. What do we got? One of those guys. Why did it go there? Okay. Um, that is a scout. Okay. Um, that's not the... Is that the... Yeah, that is the fast attack. Okay, so we got two of the scouts here. We'll send them out. Our people out this way. So we'll send eight. At this one. Hit the right button. Hit the wrong button on the other ones, didn't I? Arg. To that one. Anything else? One more of these. Uh, he's by the fast attack. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alright, kind of dangerous to send these guys near the fast attack. But we're going to do it. We have a seat. We gotta get Karen named. Yeah, he's going down quick, thanks to the police. He is... Shields are down. Okay, we got that one down. So, 
all of you I'm gonna send you on I think which one this one Destroyed. Okay, everything is down. Fast attack are running away. As they should be. And we're done. He's crashing, interestingly. Okay, everybody go home. And then we have some missions. Well, actually, these aren't even, aren't even full missions. These are, uh... Pick up missions. I can't click the right buttons today. Go home. This is being has been surprisingly easy uh, because we're getting these little guys that coming at us, which is awfully nice of the game. I do appreciate that game. Oh, I didn't check. Uh, I didn't. I wanted to watch him shoot. So head back, and we'll go scoop those up. Check our graphs one final time. Why is nothing moving? Oh, because the graphs are just like... There we go. Alright. Uh, I need... Well... Yeah. Hop on, guys. And let's go scoop it up. We got one here and one... Where's the other one at? There. Did we get three of them or just the two? Just the two. Oh, that's right. We blew one up. Who was this? Nanotech. Uh, how do they feel about that? <laughs> Mutant Alliance is unfriendly. What? I just saved you. Where's Nanotech? Surely they they hate me now. No? Do you like me? Where are they? How did I... Did I miss them? Oh, there they are. They're still neutral. All right. Stop shooting at things. <laughs> Sorry about your business. <laughs> All right, uh, let's go. Let's go over to this one. Guns are off. Where is it? Is it this? I don't know. Yeah, go there. <laughs> All right. Going home. And let's investigate some graphs. And everything is is as it should be. What a peaceful, peaceful mission. Peaceful episode. We have um, nothing too exciting at the moment. As soon as these slums get built. Is there any reason to put people in here? I mean, I guess the place could get attacked. So maybe we should put some sort of like a security thing. Security station. Um, if I if I want to equip it, I'll have to put in a where is it? A living quarters and a stores, won't I? I probably should do that because it could get attacked, and that would be a bad thing. We just have a uh, like a guard duty crew. Okay, store and a living quarters. I'll probably need, I'll need the stores anyways for things that we make. Um, I will actually probably need a repair bay too, right? Do I need a repair bay, or do they... Maybe not. That should be okay for now. Um, no, maybe not, because that's just... If they come back and they need a repair, you need a repair bay. But just, you don't actually need a bay to have ships, craft. Okay, so we'll do that. We'll have a, a small skeleton crew of, of defensive people. We could put a security station in. Okay. Alright. This is the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.